See uh, Sam Walker. See you talking uh, offering 10k for if you find out who ever burgled your old man's out. Oh, I get that. That's fair enough. But all I don't get is your fucking opinion. Sure, I don't mean to swear, but it's it's just an opinion I know. But saying that people that rob people are the lowest form of scum. But serving up gear isn't low. The way I see it, crime's crime. Some people graft by robbing people. Some people graft by selling shit they shouldn't sell. And ends up, you know, with people living in shitty buildings with fuck all because they put it all into what they, what somebody might have sold. So yeah, put a 10k up. You know, it's part of the course, as I was like to say. Somebody's robbed the old man's house. You have the right to be pissed. And if they get caught by her, they deserve to be served up. I get that. But don't give no speech about right and wrong and shit and that. And we know how your, what your graph was. I'm not saying what your graph was right or wrong. I'm just saying it is what it is. Shouldn't go around judging people, you know, for their criminal graft. Because fuck this shit, and because there is no right or wrong way to make money through crime. Um, people like to bring up these old school standards and stuff like that. At the end of the day, how many people do you reckon might have robbed places to put money, to get money to buy stuff which is bought on the streets to put in, inside their bodies to give them a chemical buzz? I wouldn't see anybody, I wouldn't see, you know, you complaining where the money came from as long as it, uh, it came. Just imagine that that burglar robbed somebody else next door. Would you be putting 10K up then and giving your burglary speech? No, of course you wouldn't. What would happen if you found out that over half of your, I'll say alleged customers, um, made their money from burglaries to buy your merchandise? Would you uh, not accept the money? Would you turn to put the stuff back? Give him a good kick in. So, don't, don't give us that speech, Sam. Don't give us that speech. I know you're trying to create, you know, content and stuff like that, and you have to fill it up with opinions. I don't like burglars either. Who does? You know, uh, fuck me, I'd love to catch a burglar in my house. Fucking happy, happy time. They, they think if I caught a burglar in my house, um, if the police were called, they would be lucky because if I got my way with a burglar in my house, it's like the Hotel California, my house. They can come any time they like, but they may never leave. <laughs> but have I ever taken something that doesn't belong to me in the past? Of course I fucking have. Apart from a kid when I just nick out fucking sweetie shops and shit like that, man. I never ever bought fucking, you know, stuff in my body with that money. Of course I fucking have. I mean, uh, don't get me wrong, you know, if I had a clear mind, I'd pick and choose, you know, who I robbed and stuff like that and make sure they weren't vulnerable or old or this or that or that or this. But, um, back then when I was a kid, when I was, you know, just looking at getting enough money to pay my debt off from the week prior, I'd do anything. I mean, I'd even rob for my own parents. Plenty of times. So, um, be careful. Think your opinions through before you put them out. Not that nothing bad's gonna happen to you. It just make you, won't make you it will make you, uh, it will make you sound so, uh, 
It'll make you sound better if you do things through 